Masters at Augusta, this golfing dolphin called Edward Bolfin practiced with all the heart he could muster. He was the first dolphin to partake in this sport. You can't play golf, you're a dolphin, was some people's retort. But Edward knew these unkind barbs would affect his playing ability none. For he knew when the tournament started he would break the record for holes in one. The week of the tournament came around, but he bound all opponents into the, in, into, into the ground. The press lambasted him and broke him off from the start with libelous insults they would impart. All of the tabloids had their two penny worth, and all other competitors gave him a wide berth. He was mocked and ridiculed from pillar to post. He won't shoot one only par, was one player's boast. But when all the playing on the first day had died, suddenly the critics started coming on side. The Julius playing that day, a revolution had begun. He had indeed broken the record for scoring holes in one. Of how he did this, I shall now which speak, so you will know of his revolutionary technique. That morning on the first tee, he surprised everyone. He stood on his rear fins and stared into the sun. At this, the onlookers were somewhat perplexed, and they just stayed in wonderment at what happened next. He somersaulted into the air and landed on his nose with his toothy dolphin mouth open wide. Sucked the ball off the tee down in his gullet, deep into his inside. He fell to the ground, some thought he was dead, but then the ball shot out of hurricane force from the blow hole in his head and rocketed away straight down the course past another player searching for his ball and some course when the ball reached the green he dropped to the ground and he rolled straight up to the flag and straight into the hole the crowd went wild and shouted hooray as they would 17 more times that day so on each occasion the ball went straight into the hole winning this championship was now his goal and at the end of the tournament when the three days went you don't need me to tell you he lifted the cup a perfect performance not a single shot dropped and for all these critics much embarrassment popped as it would morph in the golfing dolphin won a tournament by a country mile and revolutionized opinions about all dolphins in his own inimitable style so his golfing dolphin called Edward Morphin turned all snobbery upon his head. This golfing dolphin called Edward Morphin showed he should be consigned to a forgotten bed. This golfing dolphin called Edward Morphin as a champion was very merry, for he is now Sir Edward Morphin, champion golfing dolphin, sportsman and revolutionary. <laughs> that was absolutely amazing.